the quality of a restoration is totally dependent on how adequately that restoration and its bonding agent are polymerized and the power output and the size of the footprint of curing lights varies immensely. The lens is just for this curing light designed to create a beam which is close to parallel. We can't have it totally collimated, totally parallel. We need to be able to hit the axial walls of a preparation. But it keeps it collimated enough that versus a standard light guide, like on, say, an Optilux 501, for example, versus that type of light guide, that when one is 10 millimeters from the end of the light guide, only 25% of the energy of the light is hitting it 10 millimeters out. With this one, 65 to 70% of the energy of the light is reaching 10 millimeters out to assure quality curing deep in the class two box. So having high energy that reaches into all aspects of the preparation, that's critical in order to predictably produce quality restorations.